Welcome. Uh, just doing another quick video of uh, new features in uh, 8.9. So this is going to just review setting up uh, notifications to devices uh, when you are remote. So when you're not in the house and you want your uh, iPad, iPhone, your, your Android phone or tablet to notify you, um, you need to set that up per user. And the way you're going to do that is um, you'll be logged in in your user account and the entry service has already been configured and working on your system. Uh, and what you'll do is you'll go in to the users. Uh, I'm sorry, not users. You will go into the settings and you'll go to notifications and you will create a new notification. Uh, you're going to select entry and then you're going to select what options you want to be notified of for uh, remote notifications. So um, entry ring is if someone is uh, pushing the call button and, and the entry system is ringing. Um, button pressed is if any of the buttons, so if you have a keypad on there and any buttons are pressed on the keypad. Um, motion detected, if someone walks in front and motion is enabled on the camera and um, the motion event is detected at Savant. Uh, noise, same thing if the audio uh, sensor is enabled and uh, that is received at Savant. And then tampering, and the tamper switch is the, the switch on the back of the um, call box. Uh, so um, for me, I just want to know if the if the call box is ringing. So I gonna enable ring. I'm gonna hit next. This is gonna say when do we want it. So maybe you don't want it in the middle of the night, and you can set the times here to not happen in the middle of the night. Um, and then the notification. Now, when you go into the notification delivery, if you do email, it's obviously gonna be an email notification is a push notification, it's a pop-up. So that will come up right on your um, uh, device, whether it's asleep or not. If you have multiple homes or multiple systems um, that you're receiving it, even if you're logged into a different home or system, you will receive the notification for the other system. So um, the notification is what we want. I'm gonna click done and done. And now I'm back to the notifications page. We'll see entry right there, and the checkbox indicates it's enabled, and that's it. Um, nothing else needs to be done. So uh, hopefully that was uh, helpful for you, and uh, if you need more uh, videos, just click uh, on the subscribe button. And uh, I definitely am posting videos pretty regularly now, and uh, uh, hopefully I can have something up there that helps you out. Have a good one.